Yes, that's what they're eating. We called them bare handed. That's what them big bass like. He's got a little chartreuse on his back, don't he? And down there, then on his tails. I'm surprised I got him back, but this is 10 pound shooter, which is the reason I throw it. Didn't want to swing him because I did. I mean, he had to chew me up. It ain't that bad, actually. He threw my worm, which look at how fat. The only reason I'm saying that is because he's going to ball of fry right there, and he is absurdly fat. But, the little Nico in there, I'm surprised. Like, he had me wrapped up around that metal, and that's rusty metal you can see right there. I thought I was going to break him off for sure. Never pulled against him. We're not in a tournament. So we just going to send it one time. Okay, rig me up another worm now because he got my worm, threw it off right here today. Pretty simple rig though. Had me a red bug, or I think it's called red chili. BFF. I'm gonna go in a different way. I'm going just like that. Gonna get me a little little weight. A little Nico weight. That might have been the last one I had of that size. Gonna have to place an order. Come back out. I have to go on Shop Carl's and get me a, some stuff on the way for get it shipped to our house over at Fork. Pretty simple little rig though. You just take this worm, rig it wacky style. Wacky worm and wacky rig and whatever you want to say. And I'll just slide that little nail weight up in there. And then just fall straight down. And whenever you wiggle it, it just, see how it falls? Straight down, and whenever you wiggle it, it just moves a little. Just like that weight, man, but lets you be able to go a little faster. about tired. He got a lot of hooks in him. Kyle's caught a couple fish today. Today's not been bad. We ain't been out here that long either. He Got caught a, what kind of bass? I don't know, yellow bass, white bass, something. Ugly sucker. What's that ugly? Hmm? And then you caught a little tiny large mouth. Then you caught an all right large mouth. Caught two this size, lost one this size. And then he actually seen this one like blowing up on top water and threw over there and caught him. Didn't. Sure did. I got him pretty daggum good to tell you the truth. Tell you the fact of the matter. So how did you know there were bass blowing up this time? You can just, I can just tell by the sound they make. Their bass are stripe or whatever they all sound a little bit different dude i cannot believe this my hook is trashed these hooks ain't no good in the first place didn't change these yet well broke that one trying to get it out little little chunky one yeah we just 
splashed hunter big time i hadn't changed the hooks on this to some gamakatsus yet but these these hooks are whatever god hammer cracking <laughs> Hammer. <laughs> Look at that thing. <laughs> We've caught some big everything today but bass. We've caught uh, everything but a big bass pretty much. Man. Look at that sucker. It's a pretty good one. Pretty nice one. Big bluegill. We could be opening up a fish restaurant today. There's a skinny one. Skinny little shad eater. Yeah. So this video is gonna be how many different species of fish we can catch in one day. So yep. right now we're on one. Right now we got one. Number one. Black crappie. Pretty one too. Species number two, smallmouth bass. Smallmouth. Let's see what the second one is. What is it gonna be, Kyle? I don't know, we gotta wait and find out. That's just a plain old one. Plain old one? Yeah. That's a large mouth. Large mouth bass. They're pretty here, ain't they? Yeah, they are. Green. Pretty. Well, we're down here in Texas, and we're just kind of playing around before Lake Fork. Practice from Lake Fork starts tomorrow. And we're just kind of out here live scoping a little bit, fishing around a little bit, just kind of seeing what's up with it. You know how it goes. It might be white bass, but there's a million. It's a million large ones? Mad. Pretty one. All fighting over it anyway. Locked up. They're freaking following it. There's like a hundred. <laughs> They're all right here. Just drop anything. It's like hunters down here filming for only feet, but here's one. Bunch right here, ain't they? Mm -hmm. Them are all large now. Mm. Like good one, good one. Damn, did you see it? Oh 
Come on, jump me, big dog. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I want it. This thing has been losing. I've lost like 20% of them. Bit it good. Got me one. A little special. That's pretty good. One. That's what they're here. That's what they're like all are here. <clears throat> what is that? Species number three? Yep. Catch them all out here. So I had this little bitty one and when I came up, I seen all these other ones chasing it. So I just started figure eighting them around a little bit. Got me another one on there. Little chunker. And then a little bitty one. Well, I seen all the, those two three pounders came up with them. I seen them and I was like, oh, we gotta get us another one. So I tried to drop this other lure in there. Then I looked down. Have you two of them on there? Fish or two to be caught out here. Uh -oh. I hardly got him hooked in the mouth no more. Him in the cheekbone. <laughs> Is it off the bass? Yeah. It was over four. Tired all day, so I'm gonna drag a little loose. See him? He's a good one, ain't he? Yeah. What do you think he weighs? Four pounder? to the depths. <laughs> 